What is good everybody and welcome back to the channel. I'm here with cameraman Nick and we have our sneakers from the last challenges where we bought $500 sneakers. We traded them to see who could do the better trade for those $500 sneakers as well. If you don't remember that, I got the Amamanir Jordan 3s and traded them for this. That's $500. Nick got the... I had the Atmos Jordan 3s and I traded them for these Travis Scott Jordan 4s. He, he actually demolished me in that video. He 85% uh, win rate on the uh, poll. So today, instead of this, we are going to amp it up a little bit. We're going to keep this going. We're going to be now going up to $1,000 each on the sneakers. So we're going to spend $1,000 on a sneaker and see who can get the better sneaker. And then once again, after that, in the next video, we're going to be trading those sneakers and see who can do better. I don't know why. I just have a feeling that this $1,000 might be a little tougher than the $500, but I don't know. Yeah, it, I think it'd be tougher because there's a lot more $500 shoes than $1,000 shoes. Stores are very important in this. So what I'm going to be doing is going to the brand new versus ATL location. We've gone there so many times. Nick, do you have an idea where you're going? I think I'm going to go to request. It's the only store I can think of that like we haven't been to that much. So I want to try it out. And that is actually the first store that I got my I'm um, in your Jordan 3s at. So it's kind of like fair. Now, when we do the trade video, we are switching the last the people that we traded. So I get to go to full circle and he has to go to good time. So we're switching it up. So it'll be fine. But that's a lot a lot to come. That's in the future. Oh, if you guys saw in the last video, Nick obviously got the Travis uh, Jordan 4s and he got them in his size. And I had told him if he gets them in his size or whatever when we end it, he can buy the shoes from me for the price we paid originally because I paid the $500 for the first shoe. So Nick is going to be getting those for 500 bucks. I will gladly take these off your hand for $500. Thank you so much. I think that's much, a good bro. deal. I'm going to wear the heck out of these. I'm kind of mad because they're my size. Mine's a 10 and a half, a little small, but I mean, what can I do? I told him I'd do it and I didn't know he's going to end up on these, which are like eight, 900 bucks, but maybe that'll happen again in this trade. We'll get to the thousand or whatever. Maybe we'll sell to one of you guys if he doesn't want it. And like the original price, because it's obviously we're able to like kind of get a good deal off of this by trading up and all that. So let's go ahead. I'm heading my first spot versus ATL. All right, guys, it's my turn for the challenge. We are at the brand new Versus ATL location. If you remember, we've been going to Versus ATL for so many years now. They have a brand new location in Atlanta by Mercedes-Benz Stadium. We're gonna go in there and see what we can get. I haven't even seen the shop yet. I'm super excited. Let's go ahead and hit this up. All right, we're at the new spot with Leo. What's going on, man? Congratulations. What up, what up, what up man? Appreciate it. My so, guy. we have a video against Nick today. Where we're each buying a shoe. We have to see who can get the better shoe for that price range. So, who picks the better shoe? We did this before, but uh, this might be a little bit more difficult because it's a little bit higher of a price range. We're looking at $1,000. Do you have something in the store or a couple things we maybe look at that run a $1,000 price that would be good for us, me to buy that I could beat Nick with? Sure, we should. All right, let's should. look around. Let's see. We got a lot of shoes in here. We'll check out the new spot, show you guys a little bit of it, but I have to try to beat him because he destroyed me last time. So let's see, see what we can do. Let's make it happen. All right, Nick, we finished up. It's a little bit more difficult in there because. They have like the uh, $500 range and up, but we found a shoe that they kind of had in the back that uh, that they were able to work the price on to make it happen. So something hidden. I'm, I think I think I'm gonna win this, this time, but I think like? I'm gonna win every time. But I'm confident. I don't know. Maybe you'll like them. We'll uh, see. I saw some crazy stuff on their Instagram, so hopefully you made a good choice. Yeah. So they had to they had to pull some strings, but uh, let's go ahead. Let's head back. All right, guys, so I'm finished at my store. I got my sneaker, and it's now time for Nick to head into Perimeter Mall. He's going to request ATL. Now, this is actually the first store that I bought my $500 shoe at the first time. Wind is really messing with my hair right now. But if you don't remember, I got the Amam um, Manier Jordan 3, so Nick now is going to go in here and hopefully get better. So I actually have to give you my card again. I don't want to forget that. Yeah, I was about that. to ask. I need that card. Yeah, so $1,000 spending limit, and uh, see what you can do the best with that 1000 bucks, and then... Uh, they have probably the best selection in Atlanta in here, so I think it might be kind of easy to see what I can get, but I don't know. We'll see. Yeah. Yeah, because the store I went to doesn't normally have like expensive like thousand dollar shoes. What is going on with my hair? They usually don't have like a bunch of like more expensive shoes. They have more like of the like two to five hundred dollar shoes. So we'll have to see what I did when we get back. But good luck. We're gonna, Nick's gonna head in there now, and I'm gonna join the car. All right, so we just made it into request. I'm here with my boy Terrell, and uh, we're gonna check out and see what kind of 
shoe that we can find today. So the challenge is, what is the best shoe that you guys can, I guess, hook me up for, for $1,000? What is the best $1,000 shoe or deal for a shoe for a thousand bucks that we can do? Figure it out, something crazy, for sure. Oh yeah? You got, I mean, you're gonna we be, gotta, so, you're be Harrison anyway, so. So Harry went to the new Versus store, and the goal is we have got to beat, this is request first versus right now, we got to beat Harrison in Versus. Oh, that should be easy. Super right. easy. Let's see what we can find. I mean, I like 4s, I like SBs, I like Air Max 90s. Red 4 maybe? Mm -hmm. Maybe, maybe. What's the price range on those right now? Red 4 is about 6 700 Okay. The Black Hat could be pretty crazy. I know the prices on those are up. We definitely need something crazy to beat Harrison. I'm thinking, I don't know, we might have to look at the case a little bit, but I'm not sure. Just trying to think of like what's a thousand now because everything is so high priced. Everything is going up. And I see you got some skunks there. I know those are above a thousand. Okay, okay. Maybe some off-white dunks. We're gonna have to talk a little bit, look around and see what we can find. All right, so I got Terrell going in the case right now. He's about to pull out a couple options for us. Fine green. Yeah, I like these options right here. Oh man, this is gonna be tough, guys. Ooh, the CPFM Air Max. They got so much stuff in this case, guys. It's crazy. Ooh. We're gonna keep we're gonna keep looking around, but I think I might have my choice picked out. All right, so we've got three different options right now laid out on the table. Really this nice. is. This is one of the toughest choices, but I think I'm gonna leave you guys guessing what I get. We're definitely gonna keep it for a surprise when I get back. I've got three choices here that I'm gonna have to make a decision on. Alright, so I just got back in the car here with Harry, bro. The reason I was in there so long, they had so many options that like we didn't even know what to choose from, but I finally made my choice. I don't know. This this challenge was a little tougher than the 500, but I think tougher. I might have something for you. It so was tougher. He was in there for about an hour. Now, I know they probably weren't there the second we got there, but uh, I figured a thousand might be a little bit tougher because it's. I think it'd be easier to do two shoes in one, but we'll see what happens. We the fact go. that you just said that is funny because we almost threw a wrench in there and did two shoes for a thousand, mm. but decided not to just because of the challenge. But I think I have something for you, but I don't know. All right, let's go back to the warehouse and let's see. All right, guys, we just got back. I don't have my bag. Nick just got his bag over there. I'm not trying not to look. My bag's over there because he'll kind of be able to see what I have. I got the top of mine hidden, so you okay, can't. You okay. Can't see. If I rip mine, you're gonna be able to see though, because the bag I had doesn't, isn't great. I'll go first this time if you want. Hey, do you want to? What was it last time? I think I made you go first on like the last little thing. So they hit. They hooked us up with a couple shirts. Grab that. You can. You can take a. You can take the, this one off. That's as pretty well. cool, actually. They're they're pretty nice. Yeah. All right, you ready? I'm ready. Top of the box. An off-white I got. Is it the what university color? red? It is the pine the green, green off-white dunk. I don't even know I what think, those go I for. I think now. I did pretty good for the size. Like, it's pretty close for the size. I didn't even know what those are going for now, because I've had a couple pairs there at like 700 bucks before. So I don't know what they are now. What's market, do you know? Uh, I think they're probably a little bit less than a thousand on StockX for this last sold, for this yeah. size, which this is a size seven and a half. Bigger I thought, I was looking at a bunch of different options. I was looking at like Union Guavas. I was looking at a couple different things. And I was thinking for our next video, this is going to be my best bet for trying to trade. So, so that's they were why. size seven and a half? Yeah. Yeah, so buy is at 956 and then after fees you're looking at 1094 so that's that right there so that's pretty good i think it's it's a more bad. difficult going in these high it's like easier to get like a a deal i feel like on the cheaper pairs but i'm, I'm being quiet and not saying much because i'm really wondering what this dude got for this one i think i did good i think i can beat that but we'll see, we'll see. all right i'm gonna pull it out and then i'll let you see so keep your eyes closed all right and they're gonna get to see it at the same time all right three two one <laughs> I I I had such a feeling that that was gonna happen. Yep. I I just saw these on their Instagram recently. I sent them to Nick because I was like, you should and, get these. Oh my! Did so you guys, you might not even know what these are yet, but they pull them out. This is a special box. That's... Nike SB Concepts green lobsters with all of the straps and everything. Look all at, the laces. Those look laces at the are crazy. Purple of these laces. And guess the size? Eleven and a half. Freaking I think perfect. they're an 11 and a half. No, it's 11 actually. It's 11. Yeah. They had these at $1,200. That was the listing price. We'll look them up. But this is the cool special box. It's supposed to be like what? Like an ice tray, that's, basically. That's pretty sick. Um, these are really not that used either. Not bad no, condition. They're good. And obviously, if you're an SB head, you like these. But uh, this is a Nick shoe for sure. These are so, so nice. Let's look these up. It's harder to look these up because it's 
they're not new and they're older so the price is like vary but we did that with the uh the other ones let's see i mean i would say the thing about these is a regular pair of these non-special box brand new is a thousand dollars so yeah non-special box right here size 11 is nineteen hundred dollars <laughs> Last sale was seventeen hundred. Whoa, they went up a little bit. But the special box seventeen hundred for the special box, so it's about the same. I think we're pretty close with yours oh, being close. with yours being. I think value wise, with these being used, I think these might be worth a little bit more. This is a cooler shoe, but it depends man. who it is. Because this is kind of like it's kind of flip flopped. I would typically go for the shoe that Nick got, whereas he I would have went for, for this these. in a heartbeat. Yeah. If I was at Versus, this is the shoe I would have left. And this is kind of one of the only shoes they had in a thousand dollar price range. Besides that, there was a Travis Air Force one but they were 850 used so it's like i could have gotten two shoes i could have gotten those in like a dunk or something but i was yeah. like let's try to see if we can squeeze these so they, they did this for me so shout out to leo go check out their new spot it's right by mercedes-benz stadium really cool spot way bigger it's awesome so go check them out and shout out to versus as always been with them for years now yeah so. we almost uh big shout out to terrell too over at request for the hookup but we were we almost went with two shoes as well we were thinking like maybe running two five hundred dollar shoes but had to do the one yeah so that, we thought about the same thing so now we're gonna do it these not today and the next video when we do it with nick we're going to take this shoe and see who can trade it for the better sneaker so you guys saw we did last time nick absolutely demolished me about 84 percent or something like that but we're gonna see who can trade up with these so that will be the next time you see nick and i doing this and uh right. vote in the comments down below there's a straw poll at the top comment or in the link description and top comment why are we always on didn't the other video we both bought jordan threes and now we're both buying green shoes like yeah. what's we're green, reading each S green dunks just subconsciously reading each other's minds on these picks yeah so let us know in the comments down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. Still go spam his comments because he never made, he never posted a picture. Right, I'm getting I, my haircut soon too, by the way. We're, we're not going to plug his Instagram anymore until he, until he posts a photo because there's a, no point to plug it if he's not going to use it. So thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like down below. See you guys next time. This is Harrison and Nick signing out. Peace.